want to create these super slick subtitles for your edits in DaVinci Resolve, I got you. You just gave up the piston cut. You know that? Ah, this crumpy old race car I know once told me something. It's just an empty cup. First, add a text bus layer. Change the font. Adjust them so the text starts just before the character starts talking and ends a few seconds later when the talking is over. Type what the character is saying to each of the layers. Zoom and position them where you want. Open the first text in the Fusion page. Add Drop Shadow. Adjust it to your liking. Then add Glow. Change glow size to 14. Finally, add camera shake. Adjust the speed and overall strength until it looks good. To make the smooth fade in effect, Add Rectangle. If the text doesn't fit in the box, change Width and Height. Adjust Soft Edge to about 0.1. Add a keyframe where you want the text to be fully visible. Then go to the first frame and adjust the center X until no letters are visible. Open Spline window and smooth out the curves pressing S on your keyboard. Open Clips panel from the upper left corner. Copy each of the nodes individually and paste them to the other text layers. Don't copy and paste the rectangle since all the clips have difference in length. We have to animate it manually for each one. Now we have simple subtitles. Drag each of the clips from the upper right corner to make them fade out smoothly. Now let's make the text more personalized by changing colors. Press on the template node. Go to the text box and right click. Choose character level styling. Click on modifiers. Select the word you want to style. Now, you are free to make any adjustments. Let's make the word race car blue. Let's also add this cool stripe effect on it.
It would be cool to animate a car driving on the text, so let's do that. Open the text you want to make the animation on in Fusion page. Add the object, which in my case is Doc Hudson. Simply make it fade using blend option and keyframes. For the movement, use center X. Remember to smooth out the graph in the spline window. Now for the tracking. Make each of the text layers a new compound clip. Combine the first text and the background video into a one fusion clip. Add Tracker. Place the tracker on a high contrast area on the character that speaks. Track it forward and backwards if needed. Connect the text to the tracker. Press on the tracker node, go to Operation, then press Match Move. Repeat the process for every text layer. That's basically it.